Hey everybody, back again, another video, more app testing. This time it's a review that I promised a while ago. I've got Andre behind the camera tonight. We are going to be doing the ghost tube test, Apple versus Samsung. So I've got the Apple iPhone 14 Pro. Andre has the new Galaxy S23, I believe Ultra. it's called, Ultra. Yeah. So two very current, modern generation phones. We've both got the full version of Ghost Tube on them. I bought Andre the full version so that we could compare directly. We're gonna make sure our settings are exactly the same. We're gonna test and see how Ghost Tube behaves on each one of these devices. Uh, we're gonna do a couple different tests. We're gonna leave them sitting basically on my camera bag over there and just leave them sitting and see what kind of responses they both get. And then we're going to have Andre walking around filming side by side, and I'm going to follow him and film him and just see how the video looks between the two and also what we get walking around with them at the same time. So we'll, I'll put them e on each side of the screen. You'll know which is which, and we'll go from there. Anyway, let's, uh, let's get our phones out. Let's get some ghost tube happening, and let's see if we get anything tonight. We're at Steve's place. Stuff can always happen here. Let's go. So. Start. Yeah, we just started, and so both phones are already, even while we were just setting up to do this shot, I got, you know, talk to me, I can actually, let me go into the, the history, dictionary log, so we got, why am I here, talk to me, and Timothy on the Apple, the Apple's on the left, and then on the other, on the Samsung, as soon as we started recording, it said start. So, so should we hit record or you don't? No, we're not. We're just going to leave them sitting for now and we'll see what kind of responses we get out of the two devices. I'm actually thinking I should put the mic on the bag in between them. That might be a good idea because you'll still be able to hear me, and you'll be able to hear Andre, and you'll be able to hear both phones. So, again, we have full version on both devices. It's just using the front-facing camera right now, so if I put my hand, you can see my hand. Andre, do Andre's hand. So my phone, the Apple, on the left. Andre's phone, the Samsung, on the right. So if you're here... Lady. Lady. That was on mine. Yeah, that's, I'm just going to go into the settings on Blood. each. Blood. Blood. Going into the settings, I'm going to check the EMF sensitivities, the dictionary sensitivities all the way up on mine, set to 1080, dictionary is on, okay, done. So we'll go into the settings on the Samsung, I don't, just want to make sure that the settings are the same on both devices, so we're going to turn up the dictionary sensitivity on that one as well, so there we go. Not likely. Moron. <laughs> who's, who's the moron? That's funny. So, they both have maximum sensitivity set now. Are you saying we're morons? <laughs> what do you want? We, we actually just want to talk to you and see which of these two devices is better for talking to you. If you can use these devices, whichever one you feel more comfortable with. I'm Eternal, Sarah. Is there a Sarah here? And why are you Eternal? Let's see. This is always interesting. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I've got actually a very strong battery. That's actually from my Phasm Cam. So it's the battery for the Phasm Cam. But it's very strong and as you can see it drives the EMF meter like crazy. So let's see. Yep. So they both go crazy. I would say the Apple might be a little more sensitive but it works for both so we'll 
keep that away from them because it keeps setting them off. False. False? Is that you setting them off then? Can you do it again? Can you make that happen? Just by coming close to either device, if you can make that happen. I'm going to keep that battery away. Grave. Grave. This one's higher. I think the apple's a bit higher. So I'm just gonna go, I don't think. Stop. Okay. Bright. Yeah, the lights are bright. These guys are what, sitting about 12 inches apart right now? Yep, roughly. Just an arbitrary distance to make false. sure. False. False again? <laughs> we need a tape measure. Can you tell me whose house this is? We need both phones to fit in the camera view, so. I would say they've both probably so far been equally as active. Maybe a little bit more out of the apple so far. Mm -hmm. Sing. No, no, I am not gonna sing. Neither am I, sorry. Nobody wants to hear that in YouTube land. No. Nobody. <laughs> Finish. Yep, finished. I'm done singing. <laughs> Before I even started. What amazes me is something as simple how as How many? This. I don't know. How many of you are there? There are two of us. At least I think two. There might be three. Depends on what day of the fireplace. week Fireplace. Look. You want us to look at the fireplace? Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. You're very chatty on that one. Yep. We will go look in the fireplace, though. Once we are done Surgeon. Here. Surgeon. Seance. <laughs> Do you not like the other one? You've got the other device there. Do you not like it? I wonder how many of these ghost hunting videos someone on the crew does this. There was a noise. It's dark. It is dark down there, actually, where I threw that thing. Ah. I threw the thing that made the noise. Apparently, they Sarah. Are. They've both said Sarah now. Yep. So both devices have said Sarah. Is is there a Sarah here? Is Sarah maybe the little girl that we talked to one time here? If you can come close to either of the devices, if Sarah is here, you can touch them. See, so just me touching them won't make anything happen with just my hand. But if you were to bring your energy by them, you can make them light up. Can you do that? Just bring your energy by them. Either one. Who are you? My name is Brian. I'm, and a I'm Andre. This is probably the most we've had here in a while. Mm -hmm. We want to get really, really interesting for a couple minutes. Maybe we set up a spirit box while the two phones are running ghost tubes. Just for a couple of minutes, just to see what happens. I think it might be an interesting experiment. So we're gonna set that up real quick here. We'll still use this same spot because we're getting a lot of activity here. But let's get a spirit box happening too. I don't want too much of it, but it would be interesting just to see, especially if we can get some of the words that we've heard through ghost tube through the spirit box, or with the spirit box going, if we get the same word at around the same time through all of them. Just a little interesting experiment. Let's set it up and do it. Let's go. I want to talk. Night. 
I'm getting the shot set up with the spirit box, and you're still talking to us, so we're going to keep recording. It's clearly, like you said, you want to talk. So we are going to keep talking. I'm going to put the spirit box up on the shelf up here so that it's separate from the two other devices. Oh, it's dark. That's both devices have now said it's dark. Children. Is Sarah one of the children? Where? Douglas. Douglas. Okay. I've got the spirit box ready. So I'm going to take the S box touch. here. Touch. Can you touch one of the phones? I'm going to put the spirit box. Pop it's it up. not easy. I'm sure it's not easy, but if you can do it, then we will know. And we've also got this other device now up in the cupboard. I'm just gonna try and prop Sit it up. Sit down. There. Sit down. There. Turn it up a little bit. So you've now got a few different ways you can communicate with us. Abused. Abused. I don't like to that too loud. I want to be able to hear it through the mic, but I want you to be able to hear us too. Can you give us your name through this device up on the shelf? Come here. And this one, see the EMF on this one going up a little bit? And then this one said come here. This one, the EMF's not doing anything. No. This one, it's kind of jittery and a bit higher. <laughs> I don't know why. But it's funny, this one's got the higher EMF reading and it's getting more activity. But they're both getting pretty good activity. Yeah. Good to see. Yeah, I think I'd be more troubled if one was going crazy and the other one was completely silent. That would bother me more. What date is it? Um, April 6th, I think. April 6th, 2023. At the time of recording this. Why? Why am I recording this? Uh, because we want to to talk to you and see what you have to say and share it with the world. That's why we are recording this. Do you have anything you'd like to tell us about what happened here? Cursed. You were cursed? Elderly. Cursed and elderly. Is that why there was a hospital bracelet? 
with the name Steve on it? I know. What do you know? Are you Steve? Okay. I'm just going to get rid of that for now. Put it away. Go back to just. This is a ghost tube comparison, so we'll just go back to direct ghost tube comparison. Okay, I think we are going to stop this experiment. Give you one last chance to say anything. And then what we're going to do is set up, and Andre is going to walk around with one phone in each hand. We'll keep the iPhone on the left and the Samsung on the right, so it's consistent all the way through. And we'll be recording through the phones so you can see the video quality through each of the phones. I hear you. I thank you. I'm glad you hear me. We hear you as well. Not all of us. Not all of you can hear? Are some of you upstairs or downstairs? Anyway, I'm going to film Andre while he is filming through the phones. And we're just going to do a comparison of the video, how it looks, how many responses we get walking around filming. And I'll have each phone on either side of the screen. So the Apple on the left, the Samsung Please on the come right. Back. Oh, we'll come back. We'll keep coming here. Don't worry. We do want to go check out the fireplace because you told us to do that, though. So that's we're going to do that with the phones uh, in just a second. Okay, let's uh, let's get that shot set up and do that. Okay, Andre's hitting record on both phones. Boom. Sync them up. It'll be on the corner of the screen. I'm going to keep Andre in the middle. So we're going to the fireplace because somebody told us to go there. Doo -doo. Is there anybody here that can use the devices in Back. Andre's hand? Back? I'm lost. See, weird because I'm putting the phones together. The Samsung EMF is going up. This one stays down. Interesting. But then I, I don't know, man. But when you put them together, it's a Lewis, I see you. Lou, okay. Who, I told her. Whoa. Huh. Who's Lewis now? So now you get to see the video quality of the phones too. In a very low light situation. Is the brightness on my phone down? I think so. And I just... Church. There. Now it's a little more comfortable. <laughs> yeah. It was looking a little dull there. Okay, yeah, now... Now, the video quality coming out should be fairly similar. The Samsung is slightly newer. But both phones are very capable in a low-light environment. So, I'm going back. Lori. Who's Lori now? So I'm at the fireplace. Recording through both phones. I'm just going to come in tight on both phones here. So you see how the ISO is not where it needs to be for this. But that's okay. Both phones doing the same thing side by side. It's not for you. What's not for us? The fireplace? You told us to go to the fireplace. I know, and you've been very active. Assuming you're the same person. Been very active here, which is good. Again. Immune. Immune to what? We were down in the basement. A lot of water down there. Kind of flooded a bit though. Please leave. 
Oh, come on. Yeah. Come on. Thank you. Like You're welcome. But we don't want to leave. We want to talk. You've been great tonight. That is the front door. It's open. So from a distance, I can see just the view of the phones. You got a lot more color on yours. Now, I don't know how that will translate to the final video. Beside you, I'm coming. Are you a friend? Yes, I'm a friend. So can you true. can you make can you make the phones go? If you can actually point at that that wall again over there. I'm just going to come in and adjust the ISO to show okay. what we're seeing. But see, the, look at the EMF meter on my phone. Yeah. Even... You can see here. But your phone should be... The color on the Samsung is a lot brighter. But they both look good. Yeah. Back up and bring this back up to the ISO where I can actually record you. What else can you tell us? Throat. Throat. Which EMF is going crazy? Yours now. Right. Weird. Wasn't yours just going crazy a second ago? Yeah. Hidden. Who's hidden? Show yourself, please. Can you make a noise in the house for us? Touch my hand? Laura had her head touched in the basement here. So here, let's go. Brian, oh my god, there's two of you. Cool. <laughs> this will actually be interesting on video, because I'm leaving enough room on either side to put the, the phone footage. That's going to look awesome, actually. <laughs> so here, back to the fireplace. You guys are chatty here tonight. Anyway, I think we can probably conclude this little experiment with uh, both phones work really well. Both get a lot rituals. of communication. R what kind of rituals? There have actually been a few overlaps on what we've got on the devices. It's time to uh, stop the recordings and wrap up this video. Let's do that. So there you have it. Ghost Tube, Samsung versus Apple, iPhone 14 Pro versus Galaxy. No, uh, S23. S23 Ultra. S23 Ultra. So iPhone 14 Pro, S23 Ultra, I don't know the Samsung phones. Sorry, I'm an Apple guy. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, interesting. It's fun to watch them play off each other. It's almost like they're having a conversation at some points. And we got a lot of activity here tonight at Steve's place, which was fantastic as well. Really helped just have them go side by side. Anyway, if you like these videos, if you have some other apps that you think I should buy for Andre so that we can do a side by side, I'm not gonna make Andre buy apps to test on my channel. But if you want something tested, Samsung versus Apple on current gen phones, drop it in the comments below. Let me know if, uh, if it's feasible, if it's available on Samsung and we can do it, we will. Because why not? Anyway, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Follow me, hit the notification bell. I post every Sunday, eight o'clock more of these app reviews, more investigations, and just more random craziness like this. Let's find something.